Hi, today we're going to look at voltage regulators, in particularly AMS 1117. So th this particular model that we're going to look at uh, is going to regulate a voltage at 3.3 volts and the output current can be as high as 1 ampere. So this guy that we're going to use is, comes as a SOT223 package. It's a really tiny uh, voltage regulator where the first pin is the ground pin, the second pin is the V out, in our case 3.3 volts, and V in can range from anywhere from 5 volts to 12 volts. So for our model, AMS 1117-3.3, the V in, the input voltage, should be a minimum of 4.8 volts in order to get a 3.3 volt output. So we have our AMS 1117 3.3 volt. As I mentioned, the first pin is our ground pin, the second pin is our 3.3 volt output. The input pin can range all the way from 5 volts to 12 volts. So the parts that we need to regulate this voltage is a 10 microfarad 16 volt electrolytic capacitor, a 104 that is 0.1 microfarad tantanium capacitor and our AMS 1117. Okay, so we're going to look at how we're going to use the AMS 1117 3.3 along with the capacitors. So first we need to connect the ground to the ground and our input connection into the VN and we're going to do the same for the V out as well as the common ground. The two capacitors we're going to use is this guy and this guy. The electrolytic capacitor's negative corresponds to the silver stripe that you can find on it. Um, so the negative goes to the ground and the positive goes to the V out. Uh, for the tantanium capacitor, the orientation doesn't matter. Uh, it's not directional. So connect one leg to the ground and leg to V in. So now we're going to see how we're going to uh, do these connections on a double-sided board along with a soldering station.